I got the greens, I got the beans. I got the greens, I got the beans. What's going on, Broncos country? It's Bradley Chubb. We're out here at Food Bank of the Rockies for uh, the Rookies Day of Service. So come uh, follow along with us as we go about our whole day. If we're not, we're doing it, baby. Come on now. <laughs> slide it down, slide it down, slide it down. Just giving back to the community. I mean, using our platform for something that's bigger than us and um, allowing people to uh, to see that there's hope in whatever situation they're in. How many cans are you putting in there, bro? Just two? I'm gonna put two beans in there for you and Alvin. We're out here, we got drafted and did all these things and all that, but we're out here giving our time and making sure that these people know that we care about them and um, just having a good time while we're doing it. Trey's doing an amazing job. Trey's doing two things at once, putting the applesauce and the green beans, helping me out with the green beans. Isaac, on the other hand, doing a little bit too much talking. A little wandering around, but hey, team effort, we all getting the, the job done. Meals like this are huge. I mean, something like this can help those kids go a long way. I know my brother did a lot of stuff like this with, while he was in Western Salem at Wake Forest. Did a lot of, um, he drove a truck around giving food to different families and stuff. So being able to do it with my teammates now is, is pretty fun. Quillen Sutton here. We just left the Food Bank of the Rockies. We're at the Denver Broncos Boys and Girls Club. About to have a pizza party with the club members. About to be a lot of fun. Let's go see what it's talking about. This is y'all's game room. Being able to come back to the Boys and Girls Club, even though it's not the one I, I went to, I know how influential all the Boys and Girls Clubs are because they all have the, a, a very similar purpose. And being able to give kids uh, an outlet, a place to be able to go. Let me see what y'all got. Let me see what you got. I'm on 18. I'm on 18. Get to be around. Uh, youth that you probably don't go to school with, but you get to build relationships and build friendships. And I, I was able to build a lot of really good friendships um, from programs like this in the summertime. And anytime there was a break and, they, and the club was open, I would always be there. And so to be able to come back and, and just be around the kids and, and to see, feel their energy and, and, and their, the happiness they have just being here, it's, it's pretty awesome. Hey, you don't gotta call it. You don't, the bank always open. I was in a boys girls club from summer to during the school year, after school, I was in a boys girls club. I made great friendships. I learned life lessons there. Um, I don't know where I would be. I'm, I'm very grateful for it, for the boys girls club. Hey everyone, we're at the third stop right now here at the Children's Hospital and we're about to go in. So that kind of brings me back to Iowa, you know, just giving back to community, uh, being able to see the little kids and you know, they're going through a rough time right now um, for, wherever they're at, for whatever they're doing here at the hospital, especially for the cancer stuff. Um, so we hope to brighten up their day a little bit, give them a smile, um, and hopefully give them some gifts here. Any way to put a smile on somebody's face that, you know, is maybe less fortunate than us or, you know, has gone through a tough time is, is an amazing, uh, amazing thing to be able to give them some positive point in their life. Um, and maybe they can reflect back on this later in their life, hopefully, and say, wow, that was pretty cool.